Hi everyone, here's Wolfie. This time I'm doing a profile picture for my social media. So if you don't know me, if you're stumbled upon here for the first time, I'm an anime manga artist, kind of. I usually draw anime as you will see, hopefully, if you don't go away. I'm a really small channel right now, right now. <laughs> I want to get a YouTuber one day, a professional one, hopefully. So I started early, so please don't leave. <laughs> I don't know, I do anime, manga, um, I experiment with new stuff, draw traditionally and digitally, so this time is... A <laughs> This time is a digital drawing, as last video, but before I also did, I think, two videos showing my art. I kind of showed what I did with color pencils and paints. And one time I tried inking with an ink pen to drawing. So, yeah, that's what I do. <laughs> This is cool now, I'm really trying to do things, but yeah, it's kind of hard. I don't always make it, so I have a few videos. This video is kind of more anime style, because in my last, I used a cartoony one, and my style really changes depending on the picture and what I want to draw, or how I feel. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, kind of. I hope you like the picture. I really had trouble with it. Like this leaf that I'm doing right now, I don't know how many times I did it over, but it was too many times. <laughs> and the hoodie is going to give me some trouble in the face. I hate doing the face. And if you don't know, this guy this girl in the right up corner, it's Jackie the Nerdy Craft. I drew her, actually a fan art of her, in my last video, so if you know her, you're definitely a grain. Cause I'm a grain of salt too. But if you don't know her, go check her out. out. Nerdy Jackie and Nerdy Crafter are her YouTube channels, her YouTube and her vlog channel. But yeah, you can find her on other social media too. She's really amazing, geeky, funny. She really does amazing sculptures. Like, she really loves anime too. So she uses anime sculptures, like she turns different artists into sculptures. And mostly she does reveals. Reveal of craft kits, crap kits, and that kind of stuff. So if you hate Crayola and it isn't good in your opinion, go check her out. Check her out. It will go really good together with her. <laughs> so let's talk again about the picture. I did the hoodie, I did the pants, and I'm just fixing up fixing up some things. I first wanted her to have a lollipop in her hand, but as I was drawing a tab, it looked kind of weird. It would, it kind of wouldn't go with the theme anymore. So then I was thinking about a phone, and no, it didn't work like that. <laughs> so I kind of don't know right now if I fixed one part, but I hope I did. I surely hope I did. <laughs> um, the sneakers didn't give me that much trouble as I thought they did. I needed really long to do them. As you will see, I'm using this as tall for the pose. The pose, I'm not tracing it exactly, so it's not really tracing, it's more drawing above it. It's a kind of from easy poser pose, a pose from easy poser, 
this is an app where you can pose different like um, people anime like you can you have children you have heroes you have old people you have um, middle-aged people teenagers you have all sorts of things <laughs> so it's really good but it's kind of sometimes hard to control and for my drawing I'm using Ibis paint I think yes Ibis paint mm. and I'm happy that it films by itself like it doesn't film like tool the tools you are using and everything I'm happy about that but I'm, I don't like the fact that they only give you like variations how to download your video on your phone they just give you variation like to a, for a few minutes like it's not like 10 minutes or something I think this one I gave 3 minutes because it's maximum so yeah it's kind of hard because I really need to make the video much longer and it then it goes much slower and everything so I don't really like that but it's definitely better than having that bloppy thing there on the side just popping up and down sometimes and having it turning on and off all the time and filming because yeah it's kind of hard because <laughs> when I film I usually text people like text and yeah I send a lot of messages to my friends and it's kind of hard while filming with that bloppy thing I think I used UV recorder or something so it was really hard because it was it was capturing it a lot and everything and the fact is I don't have the whole time to text someone so I don't really rec recommend it I know so so many people use it but still how can they hold to not do everything else during that I mean I know they edit the video and everything and they put it out but how do you manage to be so still all the time to not, to not ask anyone for every, for everything like for advices or something <laughs> got my sink okay um shall we turn to the picture again <laughs> that was kind of unexpected so then i thought of the theme of fire so like you know those magic people have fire floating of her hand of their hands so i drew a fire mark on the sneakers and yeah that's why i went for the fire thing which you will see me do in the end since i knew i was going to do a black or a really dark dark background i thought about the skin tone being light so i tried to do it light what i thought was light was actually really dark the skin tone was really dark on the end and I had to fix it multiple times, like often, really often. And the hair, I kind of wanted it to be dark because the pants are going to be dark, the hoodie is going to be dark, and now the hair, so the skin color will pop. And I'm going to put light effect and everything, so it's not going to be that invisible. So I really wanted the skin tone to be light. Sorry if you see, well, hear voices from behind me. It's just I had to film close to a window so cars are running by, running by. <laughs> cars are driving by and my computer kind of is really loud today so sorry for that I actually tried multiple like drawing apps but I think this one suits better for me 
but I just don't really know where is that symmetry thing and I don't know um, how do you make not um, color above the line like not color above the lines color through the lines I think because I know where to select so to, to everything select but kind of <laughs> I can just nervous, like really nervous before this video, so that's why I'm struggling with English today and everything. My English, English, my English. No, God, I'm saying, <sighs> help. <laughs> my English is actually really good, but when I'm filming, it's just like I'm so nervous. I get so freaking nervous that I nearly start shaking. I really get nervous. I'm a shy person. I know I talk to uh, talk too much and a lot in my videos, but I'm actually a shy person that when meet someone doesn't talk. Like hi, hello, bye. That's all I say literally. I'm just really shy, and yeah. But I talk in English a lot actually to my friends and I write and everything. But when I'm nervous, it's just not going well. <laughs> Now, as you see, I've laid down all the colors beside the sneakers and I'm working on the shading on the hoodie. The shading was okay, but the blur tool was kind of weird. So I had to put it on really low. If not, it just smudged the whole picture together and everything. I really don't know how to fix that. <laughs> so if someone knows, please help me. Because I really need some tips. Um, and help in drawing. <laughs> Sorry, I've been easily distracted by the sound of this. I just kind of feel weird. <laughs> I get really nervous in front of voiceovers and I'm scared that my friends or family are going to accidentally stumble upon the video or somehow see it but my friends honestly kind of don't care so hopefully they're not going to see it by accident <laughs> I'm really worried about my cousin He's she's going to tell everyone she knows so many people on snapchat and on instagram and everywhere and she's following my art account so, which is Afna White Wolf X7. So, if you're interested, my art is there if you don't have the mood for all the videos. Because I know some videos, are, some people are just like, no, I don't want to see the drawing. And just like go and skip the whole thing. I need to say that's not really nice because it doesn't really count like someone watched it. Hmm. If you have any better idea about this shading at the moment, help. <laughs> I watch Love to Draw Manga. She's really good, but I don't know. She chose like she chooses like that blue navy purple kind of color for the shadings but I don't really understand what she does because I tried and it didn't look good <laughs> the skin just looks out of life and everything right now so I hope I fix it later maybe the eyes are going to fix it is when I finally started editing the eyes and the skin tone. I'm just kind of here looking at the screen, kind of sitting and looking around <laughs> because I don't know what to say and I know that it's annoying if I talk all the time. So 
and I'm sort of fixing the shading on the hoodie and yeah so much about not talking in the video <laughs> I guess we are nervous in this voiceover that I really talk too much without realizing so if it bothers you just turn the sound off that's all I can say to you because I don't really care if you watch it with or without the sound just do however you like the video better yeah. here is the text that I was talking about a little sooner so it says hug me and I'll hug you back kiss me and I'll call you my boyfriend Touch me there and I will call my boyfriend to hurt you. But in the fourth line, you is crossed because I have a boyfriend and I'm not going to call anyone else my boyfriend. So kind of the point of the video is, this is a video about how I'm designing a hoodie. I designed this hoodie out of my mind, like just did it. It just appeared one day <laughs> and I really wanted to do a pro profile picture of it and on the back there's like there's written actually you can't see it here but it's written um, don't worry it won't hurt as much as hell would so yeah <laughs> so that's my original design of the hoodie don't try to copy it because I have pictures like I have proof that it's mine I just have proof so go try it <laughs> and all on all of my profile pictures on which I put this picture I put don't copy or trace over it so you can't copy it without it being visible so yeah this is my original design of the hoodie and yeah I really have many copies of this so I have proof <laughs> I have a lot of proof and I did this video because I wanted to do a proof that I um, that I actually did this by myself you know when you say sometimes to musicians like that they are insane that people tell them they are insane for getting ideas in the shower just randomly got an idea and they get it in the shower I mean, okay, you just have time for thinking and relaxing <laughs> so when I got this idea I wrote it down, I designed everything so yeah, that's why I wanted to do this video and the flame I don't like, I didn't like I still don't like this one <laughs> it's too green I'm going to choose actually a more cyan color, cyan greeny kind of bluey color. So yeah, sometimes I do cyan a bit more green, sometimes I do it a bit more blue. So it's kind of how my mood is. I changed this fire a lot because yeah, for obvious reasons, but I think that in the end I forgot the most important part here the hand and the hand this is this is really glowing over her hand from all sides if you think about it so I think I forgot to erase it but I think it just looks okay like the tips of her fingers more kind of I don't know are connecting with the fire I think the atmosphere is good <laughs> I don't know how, how I could forget that <laughs> or just didn't I mm, I don't know but I like the picture however it turns so yeah I didn't forget the hair it's just coming a bit late <laughs> for the shoe I asked my boyfriend what to do and he said like do green, blue, or like he 
he just started throwing colors and I was just like, I don't know what the picture looks like. <laughs> and we were talking while I was drawing this, so I texted him and yeah, we had a long conversation about the shoes. <laughs> I think it was on how or around the hour, I think. Yeah, he really is the dad for the, to, me, to me for that much of time. So here's where I tried that um, selecting tool and everything again. And yeah, it didn't work. I went by hand, by hand to do it because I don't know why it didn't work. Because in my last video where I draw the fan art, it's Nerdy Crafter or Jackie. Um, it was actually like it didn't do. It didn't do his job also, so that's kind of why I wanted to try it for the light effect, but it wasn't working. And in the kind of picture of Nerdy Crafter, I also drew All Might. So if someone is interested, I drew All Might, and yeah. Honestly, he turned kind of weird, but that, that's okay, you didn't hear that. <laughs> now we're fixing the lighting on the pants. They kind of gave me trouble because I wasn't sure what to do with the other leg. Because kind of, if you think about it, it's also in the light. Like the, the light also hits it, so I'm not sure. I hope that I fix the hair soon. <laughs> I know I did it the last. This time I'm working on the sneakers. But yeah, as I said, they're going to be like they're going to be. <laughs> I'm actually interested how is it with the corona in the school thing in other countries? Like how they are doing. In my country it's been okay, but there are some problems still. Some of our, our teachers hope that we are going to go to school soon, but if you think about it, they also said, well, there is kind of a chance for ourselves not even going to school for this whole year. Like, maybe we could go to school next September. I mean, it's kind of hard. I don't like the way I made your sneakers darker. Because but if they would be white, they would... Uh, but too, man, too much attention. They would want attention. Attention. Yes. English number one. Again. So the voiceover is the third time I'm trying it. So kudos to me. By the way, I got both these two phrases from Nerdy Crafter, Jackie, and yeah. So yeah, <laughs> English number one. I hope I can say it, I hope she doesn't mind. Because I'm a little gray and I'm gonna say in the trash. In the trash. I also really love Sika, her sister. I hope that they are doing well and that they get better soon and everything. I hope they can see each other sooner. Because I really love them and you in the videos. <laughs> you both are really cute. <laughs> You're really cute. Now this is the final picture. What do you think of it? I think it looks turned out okay and I'm really proud of it. And I can just say I'm proud of it 
being my profile. So thank you all for watching and I see you next time. Here are all my social medias. Hope you enjoyed and please like, share and follow if you can. <laughs> bye bye!